What's up everybody? So um, it's been a while since I've done any kind of vlogs like this. Um, I'm gonna do, this is I guess part one in the series of Road to 405 Bench. So um, I'm sick as shit today. Um, I woke up, I had a little bit to eat, and I like felt like I was about to vomit. Um, I couldn't really stand up for too long. Uh, it's probably just from the meds I'm on. I'm on uh, Wellbutrin and some sort of antipsychotic. Can't remember the name. Happens sometimes. Uh, not sure if I'm going to train today, but uh, you did just see some footage from the last push session that I did. And today we are picking up my brand new mountain bike. So uh, we're going to go out right now and uh, pick it up. Finn. Oh my god. Jesus. This son of a bitch just rockets on your lap. Look at this son of a bitch. And this is the machine that we'll be taking to pick up the bicycle, so uh have a thule or tule, I don't know how to pronounce it. Bike rack in the back, attached to the sidecar. All right, so we're just making our first stop. Um, we're over in Thornhill, or that area, uh, where Vegan Danish Bakery is, my favorite vegan bakery. So I'm not usually in this area. Figured I'd pick up a few cupcakes. Hi. Um, do you have any croissants? I do. Okay. Um, yeah, sure. That that's great. Could I have three croissants? Um, do you have any mini apple apple pies? Um, yes. Can I have one mini apple pie? And um, let's see. I'll get six vanilla cupcakes. Yeah, two of the vanilla vanilla, and then four of the vanilla chocolate. Alright. I'm thinking I might have food poisoning. That's what this feels like right now. I'm getting, I'm just feeling extremely sick. My stomach just doesn't feel right. And um, I'm getting really lightheaded and I feel super dizzy after uh, walking around and standing up for too long. When I'm sitting down on the bike, it feels like I feel better, but I think I might have gotten food poisoning from a restaurant I ate at. Now we just have to go to the bank to get out cash. And then we can pick up the bike and hopefully we don't crash and die. That's the plan. having fun up there. So, uh, got the bike. It's a very interesting color. I don't know if you can see it on camera, but it's uh, an extremely dark 
purplish brown. Uh, it's really weird, but you can see the color a little better outside. But this is nice. Uh, it could be crazy, but it feels lighter than the mountain bike I got last year. Um, the components are better quality. This is a Rain E plus 2. Got Zeb front forks, Fox float rear shock, and it feels super smooth. Uh, the suspension feels way smoother than the last bike, and um, better brakes as well. I didn't look at the full component list on the website, but these are adjustable as well. So this will be pretty sick to ride. So I'm still feeling sick as shit. I'm pretty sure I got food poisoning because it's not getting better and my stomach hurts and I'm dizzy. But uh, I'll eat some cupcakes now to make it all better. And uh, this dog has learned how to use my weight bench. <laughs> my. What are you doing? Hmm? Wow. Oh my god. Now these are some special dogs. Oh, Faye's doing an inspect too. They all got in spec. Don't let him eat the croissants. <laughs> That's his croissant. I bought he it for his him. He ass. Don't let him touch it. It's <laughs> gross. Yeah, yeah. All right, well, miraculously, all the cupcakes I bought are intact. Usually they break apart when I'm uh, bringing them home in a Christmas. motorcycle. But um, I'm going to try to cure my illness with some cupcakes and a nice croissant. Okay, so it's the next day. I couldn't ride yesterday because I was just feeling too sick, but I just took the bike for a ride and it is fucking amazing. So um, it's a mullet bike, so it's a 29 front and it's got a 27 and a half rear. The 27 and a half uh, rear wheel makes it accelerate much faster and it's much easier for the electric motor to produce torque. So it just feels like it takes off super quickly. Um, it also feels a lot more nimble with the smaller rear wheel. It's just easier to carve around and turn and you still get the benefit of the uh, 29 inch wheel where it can just roll over big crap. The Zeb fork is super, super smooth. Um, it's also extremely rigid. I don't feel any flex in the fork. It just feels like a really solid piece of aluminum. I'm assuming it's made out of aluminum. Um, the rear shock is also really nice. Um, it is also way, way smoother than the other bike I had and um, feels a fair bit more linear. Uh, and less progressive. It's still an uh, it's still an air shock, but um, I like the progressiveness of air shocks. But this does feel a bit more linear. But awesome bike overall, and it's an extra large too, so it actually fits me. So now I'm just going to have some cookies, Easter cookies. Uh, Jasmine and I went to a bakery this morning. I'm gonna have. Bit of a snack, take some creatine, and then uh, we should be able to lift some weights. I am feeling better today. So that'll be that. Finish the workout. Fuck! I uh, dropped my fork and some food, but this is my last meal. It's uh, curry, mixed vegetables with some rice and tofu. I gotta change my shorts and clean up. Uh, make sure you hit like if you want to see more vlogs and training um, on the road to 405. Poopy doopy.